Hey, it's Zero taking a look at beating this out of time team with Scroll and Death Pool. Um, we're going to be using a pre taunt tank. In this case, it'll be Red Guardian, and then MLF, Agatha, uh, Apocalypse, and Rogue. This positioning is important. We want MLF to get rewound at the beginning of this fight, having Rogue go first. That way, when we hit with Rogue, we don't get any. Um, we don't get any of the negative effects put on us from that Black Knight. So there goes Scroll with the rewind on MLF. You'll notice MLF already has Safeguard, but she has no buffs. We'll address this in a second here. So Rogue gets all those effects. Black Knight's retaliation does nothing. Now we can basic here with Agatha and she'll call MLF to assist. MLF is gonna steal that immunity as well as defense up. So. When he retaliates on MLF, we're not having all those negative effects thrown on MLF. Uh, same concept with Apocalypse. We're going to special here instead of alt so that we can get that safeguard and immunity. And we're doing the same thing over here. Now, when it gets up to Rogue's turn, we're going to um, stun Captain America. And... You'll notice here, I didn't flip anything on um, on Black Knight, didn't land any effects on him yet. Um, sometimes you will, sometimes you won't, especially depending on the size of that Black Knight. Um, this Black Knight that we have here is a 7-7, so every once in a while I'll flip stuff, but a lot of times I don't. Now, I didn't get the taunt over on Captain America yet, haven't dropped him low enough, so we'll just go ahead and hit that alt there, and we'll see how this fight plays out. Um, now we can hit that alt with Apocalypse. He'll heal up because of the drain. And he's still going to take a wall up here, but that's all right. We're going to delete this Black Knight with the alt. And there we go. Okay, now we can stun that um, scroll. Since he has trauma, the stun will stick. And then we'll go ahead and get a big rewind. Everyone's got slow on them. So... Hit that with MLF, she'll heal up fully. Rogue's doing some big heals herself. All right, let's just get rid of this scroll here. Now, sometimes scroll will go into stealth. When he does that, when that happens, um, we'll just kill everybody else around him first and then we'll 4v1 the scroll or sometimes we'll 3v1 the scroll just depending on um, <clears throat> if Agatha dies earlier on or not. Sometimes she does, sometimes she doesn't. It doesn't really matter. My Agatha's not geared to your 18, so sometimes uh, she doesn't take that, you know, but that's okay. We still win this match. Um, the match plays out different here and there, but all of it's kind of the same principles the beginning starts out the same regardless and throughout most of the match you do about the same thing i'll go ahead and run it one more time i'm sure we'll get some slightly different results here and there so you can see how it might play out a little bit differently uh, maybe i won't be able to stun that scroll right away hopefully and it can kind of show you how we're how we handle that when that happens so we'll go ahead and bring these guys back in the same team same positioning again i'm punching up almost a million into this so it's a pretty substantial punch up surprisingly though even on a punch across the fight plays out pretty similar um, you still want to do the same things because it's the mechanics of the fight that really make this fight work um, not as much so the size so even on a smaller one if you play it wrong you will get wrecked so make sure that you are playing the way that i'm playing Hit that alt with MLF, and that does a little bit of a rewind. Then we're going to do the special with Apocalypse. Get that safeguard on him. Get that immunity on him. <clears throat> All right. So again, it looks like we didn't drop anyone down far enough to get that taunt on Cap. Sometimes we do, sometimes we don't. It's nice if we can get this uh, stun on Cap right here, because you're never going to get this stun on, um, on Black Knight. But it is what it is. All right, let's heal back up nice and big. And get slapped a little bit. That's okay, because we're about to delete you. Get that empowered basic. 
Make sure your apocalypse is always striker. Now let's see if we can get this stun to land. Okay, it landed. Hit that special. So this fight's playing out pretty much the exact same way as it did last time, so that's all right. I don't mind that. I wish it would have played out a little bit differently so I could show you it just going a little different ways and what to do in those situations, but that is okay if it plays out identical because, well, we're getting that win, right? Um, in either case, I haven't had this counter fail on me yet, so that is nice. And I have played this, I don't know, probably 30, 40 times. So haven't had it fail on me once yet. Um, my team is rather a good size. Um, I've got three diamonds on Rogue. I've got 7-7 seven, seven on Apocalypse and on, uh, well, on the rest of them I have 7-7. Seven, seven. Um, I'm level 97. The opponent that I'm going against here is one, level 100. Um, it is a pretty good punch up, but my team is um, is pretty well invested in. They're all level, except for I think um, I think Agatha might be like level ninety or ninety five, something like that. She's a, she's quite a bit smaller, um, but yeah, that's how it goes. Thank you.